guys, this is Dawnstar, also known as Aaron, and um, today I'm, I have a story for you, and I'm going to be teaching you how to make the banner at the bottom of my videos. So, when I've had all my videos so far, there's been this banner at the bottom which says what it is, what song, um, and Dawnstar, my channel name. And, um, the reason I'm doing this tutorial is to help out anyone else that didn't know how to do it and they want to do it. Um, like me, when I first started making the video, before I made my first video, I had to try and figure out how to do this. I spent about 3-4 days doing this. I know some of you might find that stupid, but I had absolutely no idea how to do it. I couldn't find any tutorials on YouTube that I actually understood. Um, and I'm still trying to figure out how to do more advanced versions of this banner so that I can have it going over the video like transfer it behind it and not have it like a rectangle um, but anyway sorry um, I'll get back to what I was on about okay so to make it you need a rectangle tool or a pen tool you can make it whatever shape you want for the more advanced ones so you could make something like that You know, you can make something really advanced and fill it, and then you know you got something. You got a hole underneath your video thing, and but the only thing is, I have absolutely no idea how to do that. I would love to know how to do that. If anyone has has found a tutorial which they could make sense of to make it so that it works without having to use like without without it. Um, being black in the background um, thank you lots <laughs> um, but yes sorry um, back to what I was on about okay so you could make something like this new oh, whatever oh, god damn Sorry. Just get some sizes in there. Okay. So, what you want to do here is you could use any of these, any of these like square tools or something, and just make a rectangle, whatever size you want at the bottom. And then you could actually first make a new layer, and then make whatever rectangle size you want and then if you want to put some like design into it you can go like this make the back one like a tad darker or something um, so you can go or a tad lighter whatever you choose and have it just a tad, tad darker behind it and there's, there's all sorts of stuff you guys could do to it um, like uh, See, there's just that. It's just, it's really that simple. Um, just to make something just simple that no one would really even notice. Um, my video. Such as this. Um, and then you just do the same thing as the other one. There's depth and have it like zero, just so it looks like it's there, or one or something. And then you go, you know, add some other looks to it and all this nice stuff. Turn depth into that and then. There you go, you got a nice thing with a dark background, and then, and then you just add your text, your text. And you have, you know, and you just have whatever you want it to say, and name of the video, and stuff like that. And you can have all that. Um, sorry for being, speaking a bit bland, it's like 4 o'clock in the morning. I felt like doing a story. Um, 
And so you could do all that and then take it into Sony Vegas if you got it. And you could put it in like uh so I just grab my my one. So now I'll teach you how to put it into Sony Vegas and use it. Um so I just dragged my, my first ever one with nothing on it. Uh, first thing you gotta do is go maintain prop maintain aspect ratio. You gotta turn that off, you gotta make sure that's unclicked so that it goes through the full video. And then drag a video in, a video of your choice. Choice choice. And then say because this um this video is my last speed up. And then before you go and vent pan crop, make sure you do the same thing to this video, maintain aspect ratio. And then you go into here and into the event pan crop option on the, on the very end of the video and this little line here make sure you have any of these things ticked off apart from the top one which is the normal edit tool make sure you have everything else unticked and then all you're going to want to do is drag this until it fits over the top of your banner as you can see right here beautiful until it fits over there and then you just play it through the whole video and it's all yay and stuff it's all lovely and fantastic and um yeah that's all i got for you today, today guys um there should be more stories coming out later on um more speed arts because i'm not very good at tutorials <laughs> as you may tell um, and that's about it. Um, alright, thanks for watching, guys, and like, favorite, subscribe, it really helps me. Um,